Should you put a potato in your sock or the sock of your children uh, overnight to help them or yourself deal with cold and flu symptoms? That's right. Will a potato in your sock help get rid of your symptoms, help you make uh, help make you feel better, help get rid of your cold, your flu, things like that? Uh, I am asking this because this is all over the Googler Schmoogler. I want to know, by the way, first of all, do you do this? Uh, this is my very own potato. I know it's a large one. I'm going to eat it in the next couple of days, but <laughs> this, uh, this represents exactly what we were talking about. Um, have you tried the uh, the potato and sock thing? You know, this is kind of similar to the onion and sock phenomena that I talked about. I did a video on that. A lot of people put onion in their socks. So the question is, does it work? Will a potato, and not the whole potato, guys. We're not talking about you put this whole thing in your sock. We're talking about people are slicing up pieces of, and I don't want to cut it because I... I'm not ready to eat this yet, but you know what I'm saying? You cut up small slices of the potato and it's put in the sock and children uh, sleep with it overnight or people, etc. cetera. Um, have you done this? Do you do this? Do you swear by it? Tell me what you think. A lot of people are doing this saying it helps with a cold and flu symptoms. So this is what we are talking about today. Guys, I'm Dr. Jane Caudill. It's good to see you. All right, so let's talk about this, okay? Um, you know, look, I love the idea of us trying to uh, make our symptoms better, right? Colds, flus, um, they're not fun. And the symptoms can be really, really annoying. So I completely, completely understand that. The thing about it is there is no definitive evidence right now that putting uh, potato slices in your sock actually does anything in terms of getting rid of cold or flu symptoms, okay? Now, don't be discouraged, right? Because I know you're probably like, oh, there she goes again. But I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Now, many people still swear by this. And by the way, look, if you feel like you think it helps, I don't know what harm it could do. You know, just put put a slice of potato in your sock. Now, what I've seen is some people, when they put the slices of potato in their sock, um, you know, they'll hold up and they'll say, look how brown this potato is like the next morning. And they'll say, look how brown this is. See, it's removing all the toxins, etc." This is the thing, guys. You know what happens when you leave a cut potato out? it turns brown. Same thing like with avocado and other things. So the fact that some of the potato that people are using turns brown does not make me think that it's necessarily removing toxins. I have to be very clear about that, okay? Um, and once again, there is no evidence that I am aware of or that I think we have that says that uh, potatoes actually do this. But as I said before, if you think it's helpful or you want to do it, I think it's a, a pretty safe thing to try. What I would say, though, is that there are lots of great evidence-based ways to help your cold and flu symptoms. And by the way, if it's about detoxing, remember, you've got lots of organs that detox you for you. Um, it is your kidney. It is your liver. It is your urine, your poo, all sorts of stuff. We've got lots of things that will detox us. Um, and in terms of cough and cold symptoms too, uh, instead of a potato, there's lots of great things over the counter, also prescription and home remedies that might work as well. I've got videos on those. So let me know if you ever tried a potato in the sock, what you think. Um, guys, I'm Dr. Jen Cottle, practicing family physician, on air health expert and video creator. Uh, on YouTube, please subscribe to my channel. Click the little bell for updates. And guys, go to Dr. Jen Caudle to check out my um, my daily health tips, my free health newsletter, and so much more. All right, guys, bye.